Hi guys, welcome to Nurse Minute Scoop, Memory Tricks in a Heartbeat. Now we're going to talk about IV complications and its interventions. Let's begin. Let's start with site ecchymosis. Site ecchymosis can be treated with elevation of the extremity and applying warm compress to the site. Next IV complication is catheter embolus. Catheter embolus can be treated by placing tourniquet above the site to limit the blood flow and catheter particle migration. Next is mechanical phlebitis. Phlebitis refers to the inflammation of the vein. Phlebitis due to the catheter-related injury is called mechanical phlebitis. If phlebitis is accompanied by thrombosis of superficial veins, it is called superficial thrombophlebitis or superficial venous thrombosis. On the other hand, if it becomes infected, it is referred to as superative thrombophlebitis. What's the treatment for phlebitis? Well, it's aimed in reducing inflammation. Mechanical phlebitis is treated with application of warm, moist compresses along with the administration of RNSIDs non-steroidal anti-inflammatory agents. Next is extravasation. As you can see, it's a very, very nasty IV complications. So what do we have to do here? We have to encourage active range of motion to the affected limb, not immobilization. So don't let that confuse you on NCLEX. Again, it is encouraged to do active range of motion. Next is infiltration. Infiltration is the fluid leak out of the vein into the surrounding tissue. That's why it looks like that in the picture is because there's a fluid leak. So what do we do for treatment? Treatment includes the application of either warm or cold compresses. So this is the IV complication where you can do either or, either hot or cold. And last but not the least, it's cellulitis. So cellulitis is a common and potentially serious deadly skin infection. So what is the treatment for this? It's gonna be straight up antibiotics as prescribed. And that's it. That's all our IV complications and its treatments. I hope you guys like this video. Please don't forget to hit like, share, subscribe, comment, or hit the notification bell down below. Thank you for watching. Bye!